So I've been a huge fan of phones from Xiaomi for the incredible value that they offer at amazingly cheap prices. But there's one particular issue with both the Xiaomi phones I've used till now that might as well prevent me from buying any other Xiaomi phone in the future. So let me explain. Alright, so I bought the Xiaomi Redmi Note 3 more than two years back. And while the phone has been faring pretty decently even now, the buttons have gotten insanely bad. The power button just doesn't work, you need to press it so hard that it may as well break. Now the only way I get to turn the screen on easily is by plugging the phone to the charger, which automatically wakes the screen. Same is the case with the volume up button, although it's not that unresponsive and works at times. Now you might think I'm crazy for complaining about a 2 year old smartphone, but going by that logic, I bought the Moto G4 Plus around the same time, in fact one month before I bought the Redmi Note 3, and the buttons still are really responsive although they feel kind of mushy. But what's the use of clicky buttons if they just don't click? Now it's not just the Redmi Note 3 that's facing this problem, in case you're still not satisfied for me complaining about a 2 year old smartphone. My Mi A1 that I use every single day, all day long, basically as my daily driver, is facing the exact same problem and it follows the exact same pattern as that of the Redmi Note 3, the volume up button and the power button, both of which have started becoming unresponsive as the days pass. Now this really is a shame considering how good the rest of the phone has turned out to be. Basically stock Android and regular security patches. But anyways, if anyone from Xiaomi is watching this video, please get this issue fixed in your future smartphones. And for everybody else, do let me know in the comment section below if you're facing the same exact issue. And share this video to everyone you know who's gonna buy a new Xiaomi smartphone so that they're aware of this issue. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.